Hi everyone. So I am continuing the previous derivation, propagation of waves in rectangular waveguide. So till now we have seen up to 10 equations. So nothing but we have got in the wave equations like in terms of ex, ey, and hx and hy. Uh, we have taken two Maxwell's equation. From the first Maxwell equation, we have got three equations, and again from the second Maxwell equation, we have got three more equations. Uh, in order to determine this ex, ey, hx and hy, we need to just manipulate the equations, uh, both six equations. Uh, like uh, we need to get what is ex and substitute this ex in the some other equation, then definitely you will be having the output equations 4. Okay, consider this equation 9, okay, from this 9. I am starting from this 9. Consider this equation 9. From equation 9, from equation 9, okay, what is hy? How can you write hy? From equation 9, how can you write hy? This j omega mu that will go on to the other hand. Like 1 by j omega mu dou ej by dou x plus gamma by j omega mu ex is equal to uh, is equal to no this one so hz is hy is equal to like this we have got now substitute this hy in equation what is that what is the first equation we have got in that equation we need to substitute okay uh, this one equation number this one first equation hy 5 Okay, so if you substitute, substitute hy in equation 5, dou hz by dou y plus gamma into, see that equation, go to 5 once, see, dou hz by dou y plus dou uh, gamma into hy is equal to j omega epsilon ex. Here we have hy, just I am substituting what is hy here. 1 by j omega mu dou ej by dou x plus gamma by j omega mu ex that is equal to j omega epsilon ex okay this is what the fifth equation if you substitute so now just rewrite this equation dou hz by dou y plus gamma by j omega mu dou ej by dou x plus gamma square by j omega mu ex is equal to j omega epsilon ex. Okay. So, here see here, here we have ex term, here also we have ex term. Takes e, take ex common and take this on to the other hand. So, if you take Ex common, J omega epsilon minus gamma square by J omega mu. That is equal to remaining term on the other hand. Del H uh, dou, Z, dou Hz by dou y plus gamma by j omega mu dou ej by dou x. Take this LCM, uh, j square nothing but minus 1 minus omega square. If you take LCM here, minus
minus omega square mu epsilon minus gamma square by j omega mu that is equal to this one dou hz by dou y plus gamma j omega mu dou ez by dou x into ex here okay so if you take minus common and send to the other hand and similarly j omega mu and what about this one see here we have, i have already taken one parameter h square what is the h square uh, i will explain take minus common minus ex gamma square plus omega square mu epsilon divided by j omega mu is equal to do hz by do y plus gamma by j omega mu do ez by do x okay now what is gamma square plus omega square mu epsilon this is nothing but h square we have already assumed this as h square once go back to that h square see this one okay gamma square plus omega square mu epsilon is equal to h square now we are recalling that so substituting this as h square so minus ex into h square by j omega mu is equal to what is that other equation do hz by do y plus gamma by j omega mu do ez by do x do ez ez or ex ez ez by do ez by do x okay now keep ex on this hand because we need ex and the rest everything throw it on the other hand minus j omega mu by h square into do hz by do y now minus here j omega mu j omega mu these two cancel together and what we have gamma by h square into do ez by do x this is what the equation for ex okay hope you understand this calculation just we have taken one of the parameters uh, hx or h any parameter you can take okay whichever is free if you see in the equation whichever is free that equation you can bring and substitute in the other opposite equation so that uh, after the simplification you will get to one equation okay this is the equation for ex this is the equation for ex very 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 simple and important okay this is the equation for ex similarly i am not doing all the calculations if i do all the calculations uh, number of videos will be increased uh, you can do the calculation or suppose i will explain one more uh, see here whatever what is what i have done i have taken the ninth equation and taken hy is equal to something and similarly i have uh, next i will take hx hx is equal to this one okay from this eighth equation eighth equation i can take hx and similarly from 10th equation i can take hz once if you are able to find out hx and hz then substitute hx and hz in these two equations 6 and 7 okay then you will get the remaining equations very easy okay uh, finally uh, similarly if you do so you will get similarly you will get the other three equations as ey is equal to ey is equal to j omega mu by h square do hz by do x minus gamma by h square this is gamma only gamma by h square do ez by do y 
and E E is our over H H X is equal to H X is equal to J omega epsilon by H square do E Z by do Y minus gamma by H square gamma by H square do H Z by do X next one H Y is equal to minus j omega epsilon by h square do e z by do x minus gamma by h square do h z by do y so these are the four equations for the e x e y h x and h y okay so any wave that propagates in a rectangular wave guide that ha that should exhibit these four equations uh, that means the electric field how much is the electric field in x and y directions and similarly how much is the electric field in y, uh, uh, how much is the magnetic field in x and y directions so ex ey hx and hy ez hz already we know okay ez and hz are existed one is existed in te and another one is existed in tm so if you take te ez is equal to 0 hz is a non zero value if you take tm ez is equal to non zero hz is equal to zero so likewise we will be having these uh, wave equations now i will tell you one key point here consider tem wave or tem mode I told you when I was introducing the waves uh, like TE or TM and TEM, TEM mode does not exist in rectangular waveguide. Listen, this point very, very important. TEM mode does not exist in the rectangular waveguide. TEM mode does not exist in rectangular waveguide. Rectangular waveguide okay what is tem transverse electric and magnetic te is nothing but transverse electric and magnetic that means transverse electric and magnetic means ez is equal to 0 and as well as hz is equal to 0 if you take te ez is equal to 0 hz is a non zero value if you take tm hz is equal to 0 ez is a non zero value but in tem both are zero both terms are here means both are zeros so if you substitute ez is equal to 0 and hz is equal to 0 in these four equations ex ey hx and hy what is the result ex is equal to 0 ey is equal to 0 hx is equal to 0 hy is equal to 0 as all the equations are zeros you will be having nothing in the output okay if any one equation is a non zero value in these four among these four if any non if any parameter is existed a non zero value then definitely that wave is existed <coughs> so if we substitute if we substitute ez and hz in ex ey hx and hy then ex is equal to 0 ey is equal to 0 hx is equal to 0 and hy is also equal to 0 so as nothing is existed tem mode does not exist among these four if any one is non zero value then definitely we can say that wave is existed okay so i will write with red so that it is very important see as all components are zeros as all components are zeros the TEM mode does not TEM mode does not exist in rectangular waveguide 
we have read okay i am again saying if any one is a non zero value then we can say it is existed okay as all are zeros it is not existed okay so this is what the propagation of waves in a rectangular wave